We're here in Tamaki Makaurau at the site of the New Zealand Wars Memorial. And this memorial on the corner of Simon Street and Wakefield Street was erected in 1920 by the Victoria League, which was a kind of pro-imperial organisation with substantial assistance from the Crown. And it pays respects to those who fought on the Crown side during the New Zealand Wars, including Māori, uh, but it makes no mention of those Māori they fought against. So it's a monument to imperialism and colonialism. And this is kind of reinforced as well with the figure of Māori and Pākehā shaking hands, uh, the words peace underneath, it kind of underlines this idea that the New Zealand Wars brought peace and prosperity to the country and the nation. The monument itself became a focus for protest in, in later years during the 20th century. It, during the 1981 Springbok Tour, for example, the statue that you see here representing Zealandia was damaged, it was tarred and feathered and taken off its plinth. So it was taken away and restored, brought back to the site, but within a few months it had been damaged again. Again in an act of protest, the head of the statue was removed. The original head for the Zealandia was never recovered, um, so what you see here is uh, Zealandia with a substitute head. Uh, and the site itself has also been the focus of uh, ongoing attacks in recent years. You can see remnants of spray paint on it and even on the figure of Zealandia. So this is one of those contested sites in terms of how we remember the New Zealand Wars.